Hi, my name is Kelly Lomack and I'm a pediatric nurse practitioner student at the University of Texas El Paso. This is my patient Reagan and she has volunteered to uh, set for me to do a physical assessment head to toe. Hi Reagan, how are you? Good, how are you? Thank you for volunteering for this. Alright, first of all I went ahead and washed my hands and we took her vital signs. Her blood pressure was 106 over 67, her pulse was 84, her respirations were 16, and her temperature was 98.3. Are you ready to begin? Yes. Okay, here we go. All right. We're going to start with your head. We're going to make sure it's nice and symmetric. There's no lumps, not bumps or bruises going on. The hair distribution is great. There's no balding spots. All right. Nice and full. And check your facial bones. Everything seems to be intact. Does that cause you any pain? No. Please let me know if anything that I do causes you pain, okay? All right, we're gonna check cranial nerves five and seven while we're on your face, okay? What I want you to do is lift up your eyebrows, wrinkle your, there you go, pop out your cheeks. All right, I want you to clench down. Great, and smile for me. All right, awesome. All right. Can you fill up? Yes. Awesome. Cranial nerves five and seven are intact. Now we're gonna go ahead and look at your eyes, okay? Um, what I want you to do first, first of all, I see that they are nice and symmetrical on your face. Everything's lined up nice. Uh, we're gonna do a light test, okay? And I'm just gonna be watching the pupil size. All right, so I just want you to look straight ahead. Her pupils are equal and reactive to light. Now what I want you to do is I want you to hold this for me at arm's length, and I want you to read with one eye closed, or you can cover it up, either one, whichever you prefer, and read the smallest line that you can. D E F. P O T E C. Okay, and I want you to go ahead and switch eyes and do the same thing. D E F P O T E C. Great, thank you very much. All right, now what we're going to do is um, I want you to tell me when you see my fingers, okay? I'm going to come around from the back side to the front. You just tell me when you can see them, okay? okay. Ready? Okay. 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 Great. All right, now what I want you to do is follow my finger. Don't move your head, just move your eyes. Ready? Mm -hmm. Great. Her ocular muscles are intact. Now I'm going to cover up one eye and then cover up the other eye. And what I'm just doing is just checking for a reaction, okay? Okay. All right, just look straight ahead for me. No extra movements there. What I'm going to do now, and that shows that cranial nerves three, four, and six were intact. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to look really close into your eye. We're going to get real close, okay? Up close and personal. So just bear with me, all right? Okay. I want you to look just straight ahead, like right here. Ready? All right, you ready? Yes. Hold your head real steady for me. What I'm looking at is the vessels of your eye, and I see the red reflex. All right, great. Thank you. All right, you ready to move on to your ears? Yes. Just switching out my ophthalmoscope real quick. All right. Do me a favor and hold that for me. Awesome. Just going to check your ears. Okay, and they are symmetrical and even in line with your eyes. Okay. All right, ready? Yes. I see your tympanic membrane. 
Charlie Gray. And the same on that side, your canals and everything look great. All right, Reagan, what we're going to do now is called a whisper test. What I'm going to do is I'm going to come behind you and I'm going to say a word and I want you to repeat that word to me, okay? Okay. Are you ready? Yes. First. Okay. First. All right. Good. Great. All right. So what we're going to do now, this is called a tuning fork. What I'm going to do is I'm going to check to make sure that your hearing is equal. I'm going to do two different tests, okay? One on the top of your head and then one on each side behind your ears. Yep. All right? What I want you to do so I'm going to put this on. I want you to tell me if it's equal or if it's louder on one side or louder on the other, okay? Okay. Are you ready? If I can get it to work. It's equal. Okay. Now we're going to do it again, and I'm going to put it right here, okay? Okay. Tell me when you no longer hear it. Okay. And tell me when you can no longer hear it. Okay. 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 All right. Great. So that checks your um, bone conductivity and air conductivity. Okay. Now moving on, we are going to look in your nose. Red, I do visualize the turbulence. All right, great, thank you. All right, what we're going to do now is a sniff test. All right, what I want you to do is close your eyes and I want you to tell me what you smell, okay? peppermint oil, but that's close enough. And one more. Tell me what you smell. Uh, coffee. Okay, great. And that was indeed coffee. All right, so that tested your cranial nerve number one. That was your sniff test, okay? All right, now we're going to go ahead and look inside your mouth. Again, um, looking to see that the lips are symmetrical, nice and full. I don't see any abnormalities, okay? I want you to go ahead and open up your mouth for me. Alright, open up your mouth. Okay, stick out your tongue for me. Awesome, your uvula is midline. I do so those bumps on the back of your tongue. Alright. I'm going to run this along your teeth. I'm just going to check. Tell me if it causes any pain. Okay, ready? Open up. Any pain? No. And stick out your tongue. Stick out real far. Ah. Ah. Okay, great. Alright, we're going to move on down and we're going to check your neck. Okay? Okay. Very muscular. Just feeling for any lump nodes. All right, now I'm just going to check your pulse, your carotid pulse is right here, and then I'm going to listen to them, okay? Okay.
Hold your breath. And breathe. And hold your breath. Great. Pulses sound great. I don't hear any bruise. The thyroid looks good. All right, we're going to move on. All right, down to your upper extremities. I'm just going to check your capillary refill. It's less than three seconds. And we're just going to look. check your range of motion, okay? So, bear with me, all right? We're gonna okay. do these one at a time. Tell me if anything causes pain. Anything? No. All right, and the other side. Okay. Alright, good. Okay. I want you to go ahead and lay back for me. Actually, no, I'm sorry. We're going to check your back. Okay. Move your hair out of the way. I'm just going to take a look here a little. Feeling for symmetry, your scapula. Go ahead and sit up for me. There you go. And uh, lean over like a cat, like a care cat. There you go, perfect. All right, go ahead and set up for me. Just relax, but just stay upright. What I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna tap on your back and I'm just gonna be listening for your um, percussion of your lungs, okay? You ready? Yes. Some big deep breaths for me, please. What I want you to do now is the same places I'm going to put the stethoscope, I want you to say 99. And all I'm doing is just listening for a differential um, airflow, okay? Okay. 99. 99. 99. 99. 99. 99. 99. 99. 99. 99. 99. 99. 99. Great. Right, do you have anything in your tenderness right here? No. All right. Does that cause you any pain? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. All right. Now I want you to go ahead and lay back. You can scoot all the way back if you want to. This is a long table. All right. You got shorts underneath, so we're gonna just lift your gown. Okay. Now, well, should I listen to your heart and lungs? Let me just do that really quick.
hearing the S1, S2 sounds. Just get a nice strong heartbeat. And now I'm going to look, listen, and feel for your belly, okay? Remember, anything that I do, if it causes you pain, just let me know. Okay. Abdomen is nice and flat. I don't see any distension. Go ahead and listen to your bell sounds. Your bowels are active in all four quadrants. All right, now I'm going to just press on your belly and then I'm going to, I'm gonna do two different sensations, okay? One is gonna be a light press and then one is gonna be deep. Please let me know if this causes you any pain, okay? Good. Try to feel your spleen in there, okay, and your kidney. Okay. Take a big deep breath and let it out. Let it out. And again, big deep breath and let it out. for your abdominal aorta. <laughs> that was her tummy growling, by the way. And I feel the pulsation. All right, so we're gonna move on down to your legs, okay? I'm just gonna look, listen, feel, just like before. Okay. Okay. My ankles. Oh, yes, I'm sorry. got equal symmetry, she's got muscle mass, um, equal hair distribution. Feeling for a popliteal. And I feel them bilaterally equal. Temperature is the same. She's a little cool on each lower extremity. All right. Nice color of blue. All right. We're going to do the same thing as we did with your hands, okay? We're going to just check your range of motion. Okay. Do me a favor, push against my hands. And can you pull back? Great, thank you. Just relax for me. Don't have a great range of motion there, Reagan. <laughs> on your right side. Yeah, I do. Not on this one. All right, there you go, perfect. All right, so now I'm just gonna check your knees. 
Flexion extension, oh, in for me. Flexion abduction. to your heart and your lungs on your interior chest because I kind of sort of missed that so we'll go back to it okay Lungs are equal bilaterally. All right, so we're going to do some neuro tests on you, okay? And then I want you to go ahead and scoot up here at the end of the bed. All right, what I want you to do is I want you to touch all your fingers to your thumbs. Great. All right, and I want you to go like this. Hold up my finger and I want you to go back and forth. Okay? Faster. And other side. Great. All right, go ahead and stand up for me. All right, you might want to move over there just a little bit. All right, um, I want you to um, lift one leg and I want you to hold out your hands. I'm sorry, hold out your hands in front of you and lift one leg. Close your eyes. <laughs> okay, to the other side. Okay, good. Your arms weren't drifting and that's what I was looking for. All right, I want you to squat down. Squat down. And I want you to, you might have to hold this, okay. squat and walk like a duck. All right, great. And I want you to stand up. And I want you to come over here. And I want you to walk to the wall and then back. Okay. Reagan has normal gait. All right, and I want you to turn around for me. And I'm just gonna check your spine. So what I want you to do is slowly lean forward. Okay. And I'm just gonna check. Lean forward at your waist. Go ahead. She has a slight degree of scoliosis that you can see. All right. Go ahead and sit down. All right. We're going to be doing some um, sensation testing. I want you to tell me if you feel where I touch you at, and I want you to tell me if it's soft or sharp, okay? okay? So I want you to close your eyes. All right, you ready? Yes. Soft. Where did I touch you? My cheek. Okay. Soft, my forearm. Uh, hard, my forearm. Hard, my elbow. Hard, my foot. <laughs> Soft, my foot. Soft, my calf. Soft, my elbow. Soft, my shoulder. <laughs> Soft, my neck. <laughs> Hard, my shoulder. Okay, great. All right, now you can open up your eyes and we're going to test your reflexes, all right? All right. All right. Here we go. I want you to just relax your arm, okay? There you go. Relax.
works. Relax. Great. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> yeah. Great. All right. One last. Reagan, that concludes my exam. Do you have any questions? No. All right, thank you so much for participating. You're welcome.